Hello everybody, I'm Sarah and this is POP17. Today we're going to talk about live video online. Live video on the internet is not a new occurrence, but as you probably know, it's a relatively hot topic, especially for up and coming personalities who want to use the platform for a voice. Perhaps it was actually the human factor which popularized the new technology. The world was just getting used to downloading videos when Justin Kahn of Justin.tv came along and pulled a pretty big stunt. He strapped a camera on his hat and a laptop to his back and told the world he would broadcast his life 24-7. Justin's proposition to show his whole life was in part the story that brought the attention to the technology, but also made Justin internet famous. People were intrigued because the experience of clicking on a web page and seeing someone live, especially when they were out roaming around, was new, and it led a lot of people to get excited about the possibilities. One other person who got excited right from the start was... Me? I was thinking of I, Justine. A too perfect of a name to go live with Justin. Justine Ezrick built up a really big following and became famous on the Justin.tv platform as a first adopter just like Justin. Ironically, it was Justine's pre-recorded video of her extended iPhone bill which most people know her for. The cult of iJustine. Another kind of popularity has taken shape on the live platform scene. The know-it-all tech geek. In this case, know-it-all is not a derogatory title, it's an honor. Chris Perillo comes from a long history of niche influence in a number of different online circles and his live stream on Ustream is a pretty big deal. Chris always has a lot of people hanging out on his channel talking tech. The barrier to entry is so low. And in case you didn't think it was low enough, just hold tight because it's about to change real soon. Last week I was at a YouTube party here in NYC and I asked Steve Chen what his plans were for adding live streaming functionality to the site. When are you guys going to do live video on YouTube? 2008. We'll do it this year. Live videos are just something that we've always wanted to do. We've never had the resources to do it correctly, but now with Google, we hope to actually launch something this year. That's some breaking news right there. I haven't seen anyone else mention anything about this yet. If YouTube does add this functionality, it's likely going to change the way people interact with each other online. More to the point, we could expect to see a new breed of online personalities really start to take shape. I've experimented with Justin TV, Ustream, Blog TV, Mogulus, and Yahoo's new streaming video. And the one thing all these platforms have in common is the need for people. Which leads me to tomorrow. Every Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern, we can discuss the topics of Pop17 Live on Mobilis. This is a great time to meet and interact with you live. You can also subscribe to my live alerts via Twitter, RSS, or email, and I'll let you know when I go live at other times throughout the week, sometimes spur of the moment. Just go to pop17.com live on Friday, and I'll chat with you then.